this is Lisa from Casa de Green the Art. I am back with another functional art project. I am on a roll with these. I am really, really enjoying them. I hope you are too. This one I am going to try to do a peacock theme with this because this hook kind of reminds me of peacock feathers. So I'm going to try to do that. This is a 12 by 16 inch piece of wood. I've actually taped it up. It has a little bit of a bevel right here. So I've gone ahead and taped up to that bevel. I thought that would look really cool to kind of just do the top of it um, and not have it run down the sides this time. I'm going to be using uh, Pebeo, I can never remember that it, Fine Gold on that. I'm also going to be using Military Green Shimmer by Porridge Posse Paints, Iridescent Green by Pevio, Lemon Lime Shimmer by Porridge Posse Paints. I love this color. It's so beautiful. Thalo Blue Red Shade by Atelier, Thalo Turquoise by Atelier, Twenty Twenty One Beach Retreat Shimmer by Porridge Posse Paints, long name. Permanent Blue Violet by Amsterdam. Rogue by Master's Touch. And Sangria by This Little Piggy. This is a lot of colors and not a huge space. So that is another part of my trying to figure out exactly how all this is going to work. But we can give it a shot see where it goes and uh, this is art it can always be changed scraped and redone I didn't talk over this part um, I think because I had redone it so many times I just wanted to concentrate on it and get it done so this part is a little quiet I also wanted to let you know I didn't waste any of that paint I did all scrape it and it's going to be an amazing base color for something else winner I am so excited oh, let me get this light out of here a little bit okay I like this the best I'm gonna go grab the piece that goes over the top um, so we can kind of show you that that is gonna look really good I am really excited about it I got the look that I wanted let me um, take you down and show you a close-up Okay, the studio lights are down, and the cell action 
is I think going to be really great on this one. I wish I had a little bit more of that, you know, mauvey purpley color at the top, but I am not going to complain. I'll come back and show you when it's dry. Here is the dried result. There's not resin on this yet, but I did want to show it to you. I have all the studio lights down and the flash on on the phone. This came out really pretty. I love these colors together. I'm going to have to do something a little bit more or a little larger with these colors. Absolutely gorgeous. Thank you so much for watching. Please like, subscribe, and hit the alarm bell. I'll see you next time.